All right, welcome everyone to this next uh, challenge solution. So what we'll be doing in this one is essentially making the wall invisible like so uh, after it touches it. So let me show you essentially the setup and how this general idea will work. Um, obviously you saw that it doesn't tween uh, as I didn't uh, do that, but the general idea of this setup is we're gonna have an area 3D, a mesh and a collision shape. Now this is different than 2D because there's no, uh, modulation right it's different what we need to do is first for the mesh uh, and the way i do this is the surface material override uh, i had some issues accessing the material through here uh, it was just kind of annoying now if you don't have this right all you can do is just drag this in from the material and this overrides this so it doesn't even matter anymore now inside of the uh, material itself we need to go to transparency and make sure alpha is on if it's not on we're not going to be able to make this invisible now, the cool part is I can make it invisible by editing the A of the color. Now, uh, if you want to tween this, I would definitely encourage you trying it. Uh, and if you can do it, let me know. Um, but essentially, all I did in my script is first we check for the player if we enter the area. And then I'm going to get access to the mesh, right? Get the surface uh, override material. It's a function inside of the mesh instance. You can even see it right here. We can find it, uh, get surface override material uh, and there's a few other functions you can definitely check out um, but back over here we get the zero right because this is the zero right here and then we get the albedo color dot a and set it to zero now if you want to slowly uh, transform it to zero that's also good and that would give a more smooth effect um, but this results in this where we now can uh, touch the wall and it turns invisible. So that's the solution to this previous challenge. Uh, if you guys enjoyed this challenge or want to uh, join the weekly challenges, just put your email down below in the first email list or in the first link. And if you guys enjoyed this video, uh, hit the subscribe button and I will see you guys next week.